All right, it's time for me to do a little craft project that I need to do every once in a while. So I thought I would show you how I make my drawing gloves for almost free, 25 cents each. Uh, this is my old one here. And uh, what happens is when you're drawing on either Wacom tablet or your iPad drawing tablet, that kind of thing, if you're not wearing the drawing glove, your hand isn't gonna be able to flow nicely over the surface. It's gonna kind of stick to it. And that just is not conducive to drawing, especially as you get kind of sweaty from overexerting yourself. Also, uh, if you have like an iPad or something like that, your pinky is gonna end up triggering things on your app. Even if you have it set to just draw with the pen, it still ends up triggering things in the menus and stuff like that. You really gotta have a glove on. I go to the dollar store and I buy this. It's two pairs of magic gloves. Gants magique. Gant magique. Gant magique. Gant. Uh, I'm not sure why they're magic. I think maybe because they go on the left hand or the right hand. With two pairs for a dollar, you're getting four drawing gloves, which if you're like me and you're not great at math, that means that they're 25 cents each. All right, so the first thing I wanna do is make sure that I'm working with the right fingers, because if you start on the wrong end, like I have in the past, you're gonna end up with something that's useless until it's time to, I don't know, cosplay Phil Collins. So I'm gonna skip the pinky and then I'm just going to cut the rest of the fingers off. And the thumb. Give a nice big thumb hole there. That's it, basically. And then, wow, that, that didn't take very long. So why don't we decorate these? Why don't we make them look kind of cooler, you know? I got a little bit of acrylic paint. The other question you might have is why bother even spending a minute making these things when you can just order, like, I don't know, is it two for $7 on Amazon? Well, I'm glad you asked. First of all, those are made out of nylon, okay? So that's an unnatural fiber, and I don't know about you, but that's gonna make me feel gross and claustrophobic. Second reason is I lose track of these gloves a lot. They end up in pockets, they end up missing, they end up in the wash. So I need probably six or seven at any time. That's gonna add up. I wanna make sure that if I decorate this, that I'm decorating the right side, so it's gonna be this side. Thirdly, if in fact thirdly is a word, the other reason I don't buy the factory made drawing gloves is they're ugly. Let's just be real. Those gloves, they have the two gloved fingers down here, and then the rest of your hand is bare. It, it, it looks like some kind of missing wardrobe piece from Flashdance. So I'm not gonna buy that. Cobra Kai! Now that you've spent a minute and a dollar to make four drawing gloves, you must be wondering, wow, how can I, you know, how can I blow this money? Well, why not pick up a copy of Let's Draw Goth's coloring book, chock full of all the people that I've been drawing on this channel. Click the link in the description below. It'll take you to Amazon where you can pick up a copy and it'll also give me a little kickback at no extra cost to you. All right, that's it. So thanks for joining me and uh, we'll see you next time. 